And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It is Olympiakos versus Germany. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, it's a flat 4 5 1, which would suggest they're going to try and play on the counter attack. However, that will only work if they don't drop too deep and can't support the main striker. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer stands between the posts. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Niklas Zule at the back. Leroy Zane plays with Serge Gnabry on the flanks. And the striker of choice today is Timo Werner. And the game begins. Moving forward effectively. It opens up for Havertz. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. The opening goal of the game, then. Goran Pandev. Elmas has it. Alexander Trykovsky. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Hoffman and Havertz. Now high quality defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Kai Havertz, Leon Goretzka, Goretzka, far from a good pass. Havertz, Werner, now Kimmich, Werner, cleared away. Trykovsky. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. 
Options in the middle. And space for him to cut in. But nothing comes of it. There's a slide draw pass. Difficult to stop him. Timo Werner. Oh, a vital interception. Well, a wasted opportunity. It would have been a decent chance, but offside the decision. Well, as those stats tell us, Germany have been second best in terms of possession, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Leon Goretzka. Kai Havertz. Werner with it now. Goretzka. Great chance to make it a brace. But the keeper had his say. Well, he has to get a second goal soon. He's been brilliant today. Over it comes. Smuggled away. He takes aim. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Corner kick played in. Growing pressure here, and another corner. So the corner played into the box. Superb block. Kimmich. Goretzka. Well, body in the way. Kimmich. Oh, what a goal! A tremendous strike. Hard to believe that he elected to take on that shot. Absolutely brilliant. Well, just look at this strike again. He hits it so well. That's a great bit of skill. No wonder he's pleased with himself. Going their way, 2-0. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Elmas. Alioski has it. Ennis Bardi. Now with Bardi. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Alexander Trykovsky. Goran Pandev. A fine use of the ball. He could pick out a teammate. Stefan Ristovsky. Went in strongly, decisively. Goretzka Werner racing forward trying to catch them out well it fizzled out
Ariana Demi. Elmas has it. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. Substitution time as is here. He's driven in the corner. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Serge Gnabry. Take it away. Well, there you have it. The hosts have had so much of the possession, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. Crossing opportunity. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Nestorovsky. And a tidy tackle. Rudiger. Sané has it. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. Alexander Trykovsky. And Germany with the ball again. Opportunity it is. Timo Werner. Well, that pass easy on the eye. And it goes! The lead just gets bigger. Surely they can't let this slip now. Well, let's take another look, and I'm not sure what the keeper was thinking there. Just look at his position. He made it far too easy for him to score. And the action underway again. It's been all Germany so far. You sense there could be extra punishment dished out. threatening Stefan Ristovsky successfully cut out almost at full time and I'll tell you what playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them Stuart well what an excellent performance this has been they've had complete control for most of the game their movement clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch it's been a oh, opportunity here Stuart and it goes such a complete performance Four in front now. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? a one-sided game you just wonder how many more they can add and a fine tackle Timo Werner Gnabry with it Werner Keira Zane has it of possibilities inside the box not messing around with that clearance and there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here 
And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Well, he is a player with the capacity to enthrall Timo Werner. Let's get your assessment as regards his performance in this game. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.